In this short video, you're going to learn one more important type of construction related to time, how to express one event happening at the same time as another, like I eat while I walk. Here's the subordinate subject table, un, oh, us, us, oh, hi, and us. This word ush, that's bold and an italicized right here, means while and introduces the subordinate clause. The structure of while, clause, and column is very similar to English structure in English as in clalum. While clauses are used to express the idea of two events happening at the same time. In English, we can summarize while clauses like this. I eat while I walk. So we've got your main clause, our while, and then our subordinate clause, event one and two. In column, the basic structure is similar. So our event one in main clause, I eat, and then walking. The two major difference between clalum and English, while construction is that the subordinate clause in English uses the same subject pronoun such as the main clause. Clalum uses a special subordinate subject set. To mention specific individuals, use the he, she, it, or they form. The subject and object noun phrases occur in their normal positions with each verb. For example, Eat the boy while walk the girl. That's how it's translated word for word, but it, but it means the boy eats while the girl walks. The subordinate event walk in this example must have the s subordinate subject suffix to agree with the girl. Right here. The word us is also used in one method of making adverbial expressions such as I walk fast. The subordinate subjects are also used in some adverbial expressions as in conditional clauses. The word us can sometimes be translated as when in column. Mm -hmm as in, I'll eat when I walk. This is okay as long as the two events are happening at the same time, but in this sentence, I'll eat when I get there, the two events are not happening at the same time. First, I'll get there, then I'll eat. This use of when in English cannot be translated as us in Tlalem. The problem is that the English when is vague in meaning either at the same time or just after. Clalum is not vague in this regard. To translate the just after use of English when, Clalum uses the word qua. I don't know if you caught that last one, but instead of sweet whisk, she said caught me. And that's it for our wild clause. Wait.